Oregon has seen some great quarterback play this past decade, headlined by Heisman winner Marcus Mariota and first-round pick Justin Herbert. Replacing a hometown star like Herbert is tough, but Oregon has done a great job recruiting and will have multiple quarterbacks to choose from. The frontrunner going into Oregon's season opener is believed to be redshirt sophomore Tyler Shuck. But who is Tyler Shuck? In the Who Is series, we go through the backstories of up-and-coming collegiate and pro athletes. If you enjoy these videos, leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If there's a player you want to see in future videos, comment it below. Tyler Shuck grew up in Chandler, Arizona. His parents met while studying at Arizona State. When Shuck was five years old, his mother was diagnosed with stage four breast cancer, and a few weeks after, his older brother passed away. Tyler's mother never missed a game or practice, and always showed up with a chair, even if she was the only parent watching. His mother is now a 14-year cancer survivor, and Tyler credits her for teaching him how to have a fighting spirit. Along with having a fighting spirit, Tyler's father taught him the 24-hour rule. The 24-hour rule is when you give yourself 24 hours to reflect and learn from a game. But once those 24 hours are up, you start to focus on the next game. A fun fact is my father taught me the same rule back in high school. Tyler Shuck attended Hamilton High School in his hometown of Chandler, Arizona. Little background information about Hamilton High School is that it opened up in 1998 and at the time Shuck was attending, had 3,800 students in total. Although it is a relatively young school, it quickly turned into a football powerhouse. As of April 2018, Hamilton High School had won 88% of their football games all time and seven state titles. Shuck played junior varsity football until his junior year of high school. In his junior year, he beat out senior Austin Bell to become the first junior to start for Hamilton since 2008. During his junior season, Shuck threw for 2,079 passing yards, 27 touchdowns, and 9 interceptions, while completing 62.3% of his passes. Shuck capped off his junior season throwing for 262 yards and 3 touchdowns in a state quarterfinal loss. Hamilton finished the season 7-5, having more than 3 losses in a season for the first time in program history. According to East Valley Tribune, Shuck invited his whole team over before games to have a team meal. Along with that, if his offensive line kept him off the ground the previous game, Shuck would buy them burritos or donuts as a thank you. Going into Shuck's senior season, according to Fishduck, his development took a quantum leap. Shuck attended the Elite 11 camp before the start of the season and was on a lot of school's radars. During his senior season, Shuck threw for 3,071 passing yards, 30 touchdowns and 5 interceptions while also completing 62.4% of his passes. Shuck threw for 238 yards and two touchdowns in a first-round win in the Arizona Interscholastic Association State Championship. Shuck was selected as a first-team 6A Premier League and recognized as a first-team scholar-athlete by the National Football Foundation Valley of the Sun chapter. Shuck measured to be 6'4", 187 pounds at the Open before his senior season. While at the Open, Shuck scored an 87.66 spark score. He ran a 4.88 40-yard dash, a 4.22 shuttle, and threw 37 feet in the Powerball. Coming out of high school, many compared Shuck to former Cal quarterback and current Los Angeles Rams quarterback Jared Goff. 24-7 Sports had him rated as a four-star prospect who was a top prospect in Arizona, seventh-best pro-style quarterback in the class, and 140th best player in the nation. Shuck originally committed to North Carolina, but in October of 2017, he flipped his commitment. Shuck took a last-minute trip to Oregon during a bye week due to having family in Oregon and decided to visit the school while he was there. Shuck told rivals that he was 100% North Carolina, but a few days later, he announced on Twitter that he had flipped his commitment. Shuck had 24 total offers from the likes of Oregon, North Carolina, Alabama, Florida State, Georgia, and Michigan. Before officially signing with Oregon during the early signing period, many believed he would choose between Oregon, North Carolina, and Michigan. During Shuck's freshman season at Oregon, he did not attempt a single pass and only played eight snaps in a total of three games. As a result, he used the year as a redshirt year. During the 2019 season, he once again sat on the bench behind starter Justin Herbert. Shuck played well in the spring game that year, completing 18 of his 31 passes for 178 yards, but unfortunately threw an interception on the last play of the game trying to tie it up. Shuck played in five games throughout the season. He played one snap against Auburn due to Herbert taking a massive hit. He completed his first career pass the following week against Nevada, finishing the game completing 8 of his 9 passes for 92 yards and 2 touchdowns. He played and didn't do much in garbage time against Montana and Colorado, but became a fan favorite in garbage time against USC. Not only did he throw a touchdown, but on the final play of the game, he threw a massive block on a USC cornerback. 
Going into the start of the 2020 Pac-12 season this weekend, Oregon will be without Justin Herbert, who is now playing for the Los Angeles Chargers on Sundays. Shuck comes into this season measuring at 6'5 and 220 pounds. Mario Cristobal has yet to name a starter at the time of writing the script, but told Oregon Live back in July that without a question, Chuck leads Oregon's quarterback competition going into fall camp. The issue is former Mississippi State head coach and new Oregon offensive coordinator Jim Moorhead said he wanted to utilize the quarterback in the run game. Chuck only has 11 career rushing yards and is not known to be a scrambler. It is believed to be a two-quarterback race between Chuck and former Boston College transfer Anthony Brown, who has 4,738 career passing yards, 40 touchdowns and 20 interceptions, as well as 423 career rushing yards and four touchdowns on the ground in three seasons at Boston College. Chuck is expected to be the starter for Oregon Saturday night against Stanford, but don't be surprised if the Ducks utilize both Chuck and Brown. If you like this video, check out my other videos in the Who Is series. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and remember to embrace the grind.